Hey everyone, Tyson the Subaru Specialist from Subaru Prince George here. I get to show you something that I don't run into a ton of here, which is great, but it's a security feature from old vehicles that some of the modern vehicles still have, but not a lot of people run into it. So what I'm talking is steering lock. So I can barely move the steering wheel and I came to turn this Forester on and I can't turn the key in the ignition. So this is steering lock. So this is a security feature. It means someone played with the steering wheel after the vehicle was shut off and it's locked. So I've got a couple calls from customers. I can't turn my key. Yes, the vehicle is in park. So I'm going to set this camera up and I'm going to show you guys how to overcome this. So I'll be right back. So the easiest way to overcome steering lock and hopefully the camera is capturing this is you figure out which way you can slightly turn the steering wheel, which in this case is to the left. So you have to hold it all the way and there's some force. My foot's on the brake, I twist, and now I can start it. But before, I couldn't, it was locked out. So that is how you overcome the steering lock in a Subaru with a key, a physical key. You can still run into steering lock with a push button start, and it's the same thing. Twist that steering wheel, whichever direction, whether that's to the left or the right, hold it. Uh, it does take a bit of force and then press the start button with your foot depressing the brake. So if you guys have any questions about that or need any clarification on anything you saw in the video, put it in the comments below. I'm more than happy to answer any questions you guys may have. I do have several customers a year call me about this, so it's probably more common than I think. And hopefully this video helped you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll talk soon.